What's going on you guys? So today I'm going to be showing you how to fix the infinite download bug when you're attempting to download Modern Warfare 2 Warzone 2 update. It's not going to allow you to install the newest update and it's going to keep giving you an error. It's going to say like, whoops, something broke. Give it another shot. Even after trying to install the game completely, I was still not able to fix this and it kept just getting stuck on an infinite loop where it kept saying scanning repair. Now, if you're having the same issue and uninstalling the game didn't resolve your issue, I would recommend that you highly try this method. It most likely will fix your problems. Now, first thing things first is you're going to want to start off and you're going to want to go ahead and hit cancel. You want to make sure that you cancel the update or cancel the repair. Once you hit that, you're going to want to hit the cog wheel and you're going to want to hit show and explorer. It's going to bring up the files. And from here, you're going to want to exit battle.net. Once you exit battle.net, go into your folder and you're going to want to hit data. From here, you want to hit view and you want to make sure that file name extension is selected. Then you're going to hit type and organize the file to by name. And you're going to select all of the IXD files, select them all and delete. After this, you're going to want to hit size, make them from small to largest select all of the file sizes that are less than three megabytes after deleting all of those delete one more thing this is going to be different for everybody for me for some reason the file type was in my beta folder for you guys it might be somewhere else it might even be listed with your data folder if that's the case select everything else except for your data folder you want to make sure you keep that so after you delete all of those items you can go ahead and try to open up Battle.net again. Once you open up Battle.net, you're going to want to hit update or scan and repair, whichever one it is. And you're just going to want to let it repair itself by itself. However long it takes, it depends on the type of internet service provider you have and how fast your speeds are. And after a while, once you get to 70%, 80%, what it should do, it should automatically roll over to updating the game. Once you see that it starts updating the game, then that's how you know your, your issue was fixed. If it's still going in that infinite loop of scanning and repairing, unfortunately, it looks like you might still have the issue. So I would recommend just canceling it, trying to redo the steps all over again. Anyways, that's it for the video, guys. I hope it helps out. Hopefully you guys can get your download started for Warzone 2. I would greatly appreciate it if you can leave me a like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Thank you. Peace.